So welcome back to HEC Story Apps. Today we're going to be making our own tote bag. So for this project, we're going to be using cardboard, stencils, or you can create your own, a canvas tote bag, painter's tape, stencil brushes that are optional. You can use regular paint brushes. And any type of paint. So why tote bag and why sustainability? In our world, more than 380 million tons of plastic are created and each ton is 2,000 pounds. So that's a lot of plastic and more than 90% of plastic is now recycled. So it ends up in our landfills, it ends up in our oceans, it ends up in our bodies as microplastics. Now, you might think, well, I recycle my plastic. Well, even if you recycle your plastic, most of that plastic is not actually recycled. Due to the fact that not all plastics are recycled, uh, different plastics require different processes. And this makes it harder for companies, recycling companies, to recycle plastic. So instead of recycling plastic, they just end up wasting it and throwing it into the landfills. So today we're going to be making our own tote bag because we want to not only save the earth, we want to save our environment and we want to protect our future. So when making this tote bag, try to be as creative as possible. Think outside the box, have fun, listen to music. So let's start. Uh, for this activity, we are actually going to start by using a piece of cardboard. And we're going to put the cardboard inside the tote bag. And this is to prevent the paint from leaking to the other side. So. I have my piece of cardboard inside the tote bag and then I'm going to take my stencil and for this stencil I have this bear trees to represent sustainability and so I'm actually going to put it on my canvas bag though you can also make your own stencil you could use some construction paper or you could use cardstock paper and you can cut up whichever design you want or if you want to go on Amazon find some stencils, try to find something that you like. If you like soccer, use a stencil about soccer. If you like nature like I do, use this or something similar. So now we need painter's tape. Now you could also use regular tape. Do I prefer painter's tape since it makes less of a mess and less of a hassle? So now I have my bag with the stencil on it. So now our next step is to decide our paints. So for me, I'm actually going to be using this acrylic cerulean blue color since uh, blue is one of my favorite colors. So I'm going to pour in a bowl. Finally, make sure to mix it. my stencil brush and I'm going to carefully paint around the stencil I'm going to make sure to be as careful as possible I'm going to start with the edges first Dark much fun with this. Uh, try to use a bunch of stencils to represent who you are. Try 
try to be artistic and try to be sustainable. Now that we're done, it's time for the grand reveal. So. Okay, so and this is my piece of artwork. What do you guys think? I think this is a beautiful representation of who I am. So thank you for joining me and remember clean up, wash your hands, uh, make sure you clean the table and make sure if you're using a utensil, make sure to wash it with soap and water and have a nice time have a nice day like if you like the video and see you next time